What has surprised you in terms of the massive online courses? I'm the first one to admit there's an enormous amount of hype. Uh -huh. and, and that hype to me is actually dangerous because we fall into this belief we have a solution and we don't. Most of online is just really unimaginatively poorly done. It's trying to replicate the existing classroom and as a result becomes more expensive than existing classrooms mm -hmm. and typically the worst delivery method. That's why online has such a negative rep. Mm -hmm. There's been no really profound uh, innovation that I've seen in online education that really drives forward the medium in a totally new way, in new fashion. And I think the MOOC wave is the first one in a while to, to try to do this. Mm -hmm. If you look at existing, these massive open online classes, they have dropout rates of over 90% and you can't tell me that we solve the education problem if we leave 90% of this, the, the willing students behind. What has worked better than you thought maybe it would? Um, what, has, what have been problems that have cropped up that maybe you didn't expect? I think the entire model of having these really long really classes that take 15 weeks is really a model of the past. We live in the Twitter age where communications are now down to 140 characters. Mm -hmm. Education should be in a much, much shorter format. As a result, people should be able to make these decisions and not being stuck with it for almost half a year. Mm -hmm. um, I believe that the lecture itself is obsolete. The lecture is the best thing you can possibly do if you're inside a physical classroom and everybody has to interact in real time. The moment you take real time out of the game, the lecture becomes very deficient. And most of these classes are still very lecture-based, to be honest. Right. I think we have just to move radically beyond lectures. Mm -hmm. Now, what inspires me and, and what I think we are pushing a lot is uh, the notion of video games. Video games are teaching people something, nothing academic usually, but they're mm -hmm. still teaching us something, and they're vastly engaging. So if we can take the video game dynamic into the classroom where people can go at their own pace and they can do as much little as they want and they get certified as they progress and certification is kind of a friend thing you feel good about if you, if you reach the next level. Mm -hmm. If you could make this the core of education, I think we could do a fantastic job really transforming the entire medium. That's got to just send allergic shockwaves to most teachers though. I mean the idea of you know not making a 15-week commitment, the idea of even like taking inspiration from something like Twitter which you know a lot of educators feel like is ruining language skills and all of this. I mean, that's got to make you pretty radical. Yeah, I mean, we're certainly, I'm certainly radical. I'm willing to be radical because I think uh, like grave times require radical thinkers and radical mm -hmm. solutions. But if you think logically about it and don't forget, forget for a moment what we've been married to in the past and ask the question, how do you and I learn? How do the people learn who are outside college? I never take classes. I just go to Google or Wikipedia and I can learn a lot of stuff. Mm -hmm. I'm not saying this is the primary mode for education for everybody. I think in younger ages having more structure is important. But just clinging to something because it's been there. If you think about the 15 weeks, at times where people get physically together and they get into dorms and they sign up and you reserve a classroom, it makes no sense to have education at the slicing that you access Wikipedia, right? Mm -hmm. But because then every day you would have to make new assignments and, and the bureaucracy of just sorting right. all this out would, be, would drive you crazy. Mm -hmm. But in the online world, you can do this. In the online world, we learn uh, little slices at a time. And we have to do the same, I think, as we go forward reforming higher education. Mm -hmm.